Hi there, wish you a very happy new year. Today we are going to be talking about how to pass CAPM in 21 days. My name is Kavita Sharma. Let's get started. So what is CAPM? CAPM is Certified Associate in Project Management. That's a certification by PMI. What is PMI? PMI is a body, a certification body in USA and they also um, have the standard, the standard is owned by PMI for project management, PMBOG, uh, portfolio management and program management. Uh, this, see, understand for any person, you can be either an IC or you can be a manager. A manager manages other people. So um, if you are thinking of uh, a career wherein you want to grow in the field of management, I think this is a certificate course which is very uh, relevant for you. So if you are thinking of going for IC in your all freshers, so I'm talking if you are a fresher then, um, go with a course if you think that you would be interested to become a manager someday. What is the eligibility? Eligibility is um, you can be a graduate or can have a high school diploma. What you need to earn is 23 PDUs. How would you earn 30, 23 PDUs? You can get into a self-study course or instructor-led course and avail those 23 PDUs. Um, the CAPM exam is online on demand and it is objective type of questions. What does it mean? It has you know some scenario and then you may have to select one answer right or you may have multi-select. They can be drag and drop questions or um, you know match kind of a question as well. The total question which you need to face is 150 question and the duration is three hours. You can take the exam from home or a center. Why should you do CAPM? Uh, that's the other question any fresher are going to ask. First of all, there is going to be better salary than your counterparts. Check PMI.org for salary surveys. You're going to see the real data which PMI keep on gathering. You would have better career choices and option. Uh, why? Because you would be um, getting selected in better companies and more companies because the certificate is globally recognized. And because you would gain knowledge while you need to, um, you know, study for the certificate, it makes you more efficient. You would know more than your peers. So from the technical perspective, you would know better than others. And that's going to start from the start of your career. So you're going to go, um, you know, zoom in your career better. Let's talk about the CAPM exam. What is CAPM exam? The total duration, as I told you, is three hours or 180 minutes. What it means is that you would need one minute to do one question. And the few minutes which are left, you can do a recap of those questions and, you know, submit the exam. There is a break of uh, 10 minutes. This break is optional, um, which you can take or which you can not take. If you are doing it, the exam at home, Take the break if you are doing the exam from, you know, Prometric Center or View Center, then again, you might want to take the break or not. Um, total question which you're going to face is 150 questions. These questions are from where? So PMI releases something called ECO. ECO is exam content outline. If you search for CAPM ECO, you're going to find the exam content outline for CAPM. Um, so what it says is that the CAPM exam, which is of 150 question, you're going to find 36% of the questions from core concept or project management fundamentals. 17% of the question would be from predictive or plan based methodology. 20% of the question is going to come from agile framework and 27% of the question would be business analysis or framework. So if the total question is 150 and 20% of the question is going to come from Agile, how much question you can expect total question from Agile? So that would be 30 questions from Agile.
great maths so now you know what is capm why should you do capm how would you start off your preparation you can start off thin and lean with a book so just start reading a book you can also do google um, certification on project management the google certification uh, course is a small course it's a fresher level course but it's a good course to start off at least kick start your preparation in the project management it won't suffice the 23 hours of paid you for the capm exam but it will help you understand the overall dynamics of the capm or project management fundamentals uh, to gain those 23 paid hours what you need to do is you can either study um online courses you can have choices from pmi.org pmi is also giving a capm uh, e learning course um with a bundle you or you can have a choice to select any instructor and go with any authorized training provider so any of these um based on your preference you can select if you ask me what is the cost of capm exam the capm exam cost is right so if you go to um if you search capm pmi you going to land on this page because i'm in india it would land me on the india page talks about capm certification and then talks about eligibility this is something which we spoke about and then how much does it cost it cost for a member 12.2k for a non member 16k now if you are a student right now there is a student membership you can just become a member in 2.5k so it's a pretty nice deal to start off with capm um for people outside india i checked what is the fee for outside india and the information which i got was for usd fee the fee for non member is for 300 usd and for a member it is 225 usd um so for um, usd you have to pay this much and uh, if you are a member 225 membership cost is 127 usd and then go with uh, buy a student membership i'm sure there's going to be student membership as well outside india or go with the course which is you know a bundled course with pmi let me talk about the upcoming class at kavitasharma.net um we gonna be running with a class with the new book on how to pass capm in 21 days we gonna start off the new uh, capm course on 13th Jan- 13th feb to 2023 this is a weekday course we gonna have classes on monday tuesday wednesday till friday uh, these are two hours of classes and these are the topics which are given So the workshop will start at 7 p.m. evening time, India time. Um, you want to know about your zone? You can check at kavitasharma.net. There is a URL given to know about your zone, or you can scan the QR code which is coming on your screen to know the um, timings for your zone. Let's talk about the course, the new course which is coming up. on 13th of february uh, 2023 this is the course on the new eco the eco got changed in january and it's a very nice uh, change so we're going to start off with uh, the reference book called pass capm in 21 days by me uh, you will get access to the book in pdf format as well as e learning format um we will have 2 hours of classes every day weekdays starting from monday saturday and sundays are off we not going to meet these are the things where you can recap on homework so because of the new eco we going to start off with core concept business analysis agile going to take whole lot of discussion and then we going to talk about the predictive processes we going to wrap up on the ninth day 
um, we may meet on 10th day if there are questions and so on. Uh, understand there is going to be homework every day, so there would be a homework of 1 hour to 1.5 hours. By the end of this particular class, you will gain 23 PTUs, which would make you eligible for the PMP exam. In case you have more questions on the upcoming class, you can write to me at kavitasharma.net. Uh, what you see is the PMP study guide. I'm working on the CAPM study guide. You're going to see it soon in the market. Um, you can reach out to me at help at kavitasharma.net or at the website kavitasharma.net. Thanks for listening in and I'll see you and talk to you again. Have a very nice day. Bye-bye.